In 1956, medical textbooks called sickle cell a black disease, incurable, a racial flaw. But a young Ghanaian doctor named Felix Kanotiahulu asked one dangerous question. Why? Why would a deadly gene survive for centuries? There had to be a reason. His search for the answer led him to a revelation so profound, it should have changed medicine overnight. Wow. He discovered that carrying the sickle cell trait made you nearly immune to deadly malaria, a 90% reduction in mortality. It wasn't a flaw. It was a brilliant evolutionary shield. He sent his proof to The Lancet, one of the world's top medical journals, and they buried it for a decade. While they silenced him, American drug companies conducted horrific, unethical trials on African children, poisoning them under the guise of treatment. Dr. Kanotiahulu exposed them too. He became the world's leading expert, yet Harvard University denied him tenure, so he wrote the definitive textbook on the disease himself. For 50 years he has been fighting, proving that the real disease wasn't in the blood, but in a system that refused to listen to a black scientist from Ghana. He's 94 years old now, and still teaching us that the most powerful cure isn't just medicine it's the truth. Comment the name Felix Kanotiahulu to honor his legacy, and share this so his story is never forgotten.